the snow truck's pretty interesting to drive, boys. It's quite wild. It is really low, but it's badass. There's an officer right behind me. I'm scared. What if he wants something? Maybe he'll want something, we'll see. Oh, he does want something. Um, let me see. Oh, I can't really get anywhere because I'm too low. I can just about squeeze in there. Not sure what he wants, but we'll see. This crazy dude, man. Hello, sir. How are you doing today? Uh, I'm doing alright, man. How are you doing? I'm doing wonderful. All right. So, uh, it's a nice truck you got here, but uh, do you have any idea I'm stopping you? Thanks. Uh, no, I'm not sure. I mean, I was doing speed limit, uh, so I'm not sure what's the reason. I just stopped you because of uh, how low your truck was. All right. I, I visually I cannot tell if it is too low, but I stopped you just to uh, make sure. Is that it was a thing? Above the legal limit. Yes, your truck, your vehicle can be too low. My vehicle? I mean, yep. it's, I mean, what, what, I didn't even notice that that's a regulation. I mean, I just bought this truck today because uh, it was at the grand uh, opening at the little car yeah, dealership. I completely understand. Um, I mean, if you just, I'm just going to measure. Uh, go I mean, ahead. I mean, kind of stuff. I, don't, I don't know what the requirements are or anything for you. I, would, I mean, it, is it? If it is below my knee, it is illegal. If the fender is below my knee, it's illegal, all right? But before I do that, can I get your license, registration, proof, insurance for this vehicle, and we can, uh, after I run all that, and if everything checks out, I'll, I'll check that, all right? Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, give me a second here. It's a new truck, so let me just find it. I think it should be around here. All right, there's my uh, ID, registration, all that stuff. So I did register it today, so hopefully it is on the system. Uh, let me know if it has gone through. Yeah, the plate does come back. I don't quite know. It does come back in our system. I don't know. I didn't see who, though, but I will uh, check that. All okay. Right, Mr. Winston, is it? Yep, that's right. All right, I'll be right back with you. Short thing, my man. What the fuck? If it's too low? So, oh my god. Is it too low? I hope it's not. I mean, that's a thing. Like, the car being too low. I mean, it's not, like, grossly low. It's low. But, really? I did not think that was a thing. I'm getting pulled over because my car's too low. <laughs> Shit. Shit, dude. I didn't even, I didn't think that was a rule. I mean, a, I guess maybe it could be a rule, like, because, you know, maybe, like, is if you, if you crash into a person, and if it's too low, because I know, like, the bumpers do um, soften the blow, so maybe if it's too low, like, you... You'd killed the person too quick or something. Maybe it's like a health regiment or something. It's probably something to do that. So maybe, um, what was it? If the bumper's lower than his ankles or something? I don't really know. Um, I guess we'll find out, right? Hopefully it should be fine. I don't want like a ticket or anything like that. What? I, I got pulled over because my truck's too low. I mean, come on now. Hopefully I can sweet talk my way out of it. If not, what will I get? Just a ticket? Are they gonna take the truck away from me? Surely they wouldn't. I, I, we're about to find out. The dude's coming, coming out of here. So let's see. All right, sir. So here's all your information back, Mr. Winston. Everything comes all right, back thanks. clean. I'm, I'm okay, that's pretty good. sure this is above. This is the legal limit. But I'm gonna double check. All right, give me a sec. Okay, let me just get out because I want to see like if it's like uh, how you measure it. So what was it? Was it just above the knee or was it? How does it? What? Yeah, if it is below, all right. So if you want to come over here, if you just stand right next to it, stand right next to it. If it is below my knee, the fender, the beginning of the fender is below my knee, then um, it is illegal. Okay. So it, is it? You mean like the the front, the front or the side one, right? Do you mean the sides? 
Uh, one second, actually. I'm gonna have another officer come down here who's more trained with this, with the measuring all this kind of stuff. This is... Oh, okay. I've, I've actually never done this real quick, but, uh, if you want to give me a quick second here, alright? Uh, yeah, sure. I mean, I'm interested in knowing, so go take as long as you need. Yeah. I mean, I, I think it's the, uh, the side fenders, but, uh, could be wrong here. Alright, so damn. just give me a sec. Sure thing. Well... Isn't that something, eh? Let me, uh, let me get a picture here. Alright, so I... Alright, so I did get a confirmation. I, this is gonna be the, uh, sides, alright? The sides, okay. Um, yeah, so, but it, it is, uh, a little bit illegal, but I'm not even gonna give you a citation. You've been cooperative and all that kind of stuff. I'm gonna be giving you a verbal warning for it, alright? Okay, so, I mean, sh uh, let me get a... So, do, should I be driving this, or should I make it a little higher or would I be okay with driving this? Um, I mean normally officers don't mess with you for lowered vehicles. It's been a slow day today. That's why I, I pulled you over, you know. Okay. So, okay. But normally officers okay. don't mess with you with this kind of stuff. So, I mean, if you if you if you want to drive it on the road, I mean, do it at your own risk. Officers could pull you over. Right, okay. Officers could pull you over and stuff, but uh, you know. Okay, you know, that's fine. I mean, this is my first, like, lowered truck. I mean, that's kind of the reason I got it, because it looked really different to what I normally have. So I'm pretty, uh, new to the whole, uh, I guess, lowered truck kind of scene, so I, I had no idea there was, uh, rules and regulations. Well, I mean, it's all right, man. I understand you. You said you bought this today, so... Yeah, yeah, the, uh, it's grand right, opening of the new, uh, car dealership by the, uh... But kind of sandy, you know. Have you, have you seen it at all? Have you visited? Yeah, I, I checked that out. I checked that out. Yeah, that's where I got it. Yeah, looks looks pretty nice, but uh, everything everything checks out. Yeah, just be careful with the uh, the truck. You could get pulled over for it again. Okay. But uh, you can get back in your vehicle. Um, all right. And when we get back in our vehicles and we turn our lights off, you're gonna be free to go. All right, Mr. Rodson. All right. Thank you. I uh, have a good day. Take Oh, my bad. Yeah, uh, I, I heard that. So, uh, th you have a good day. I'll uh, get back in my uh, vehicle. Alright, you too. Well, isn't, isn't that something? So, I think my fender is higher than my knee. Or below the knee? What was it? I need to wait for his lights. There you go. Turn off his lights. Alright, here we go. We can, we can head out here. That's nice and easy. There we go. Alright, we're, we're toasty. We're rolling. Alright, so it's just fine. So it was the fenders above the knee. Or below the knee. What was it? I'm I'm so confused. Let me pull over somewhere on even ground and I can have a look. I like that it's got like a, a, a light bar at the bottom. You see that? Normally you get the light bars on the top, but it's got a, at the bottom. That's pretty neat. So let me... Oh, easy. There's a... Grand, okay, there we go. We went over it. So, okay. Let me just check. So the side fenders, right? There we go. So it's... If it's below the knee, you're in trouble. That's way above the knee, right? That's way above the knee. I think that's how he said he was checking them. Let me check the side ones. Does it matter? Oh, yeah, above the, the back ones are pretty fine as well. And then if we go at the front, uh, that's fine as well. Uh, so, no, we're okay. We're okay. So, he was just checking. Well, that was interesting. I did not think that was a thing. All right. Now, uh, you learn something new. Every day, I guess, boys, right? You learn something new every day. We'll swing it. What we're going to do is we're going to swing it around. We're going to go back to... Uh, we're going to go back on East Joshua. Uh, we'll swing it around, and then we can uh, actually get it car washed. Because it looks really nice when you get it car washed, because the chrome and everything pops. It looks super good. It's actually kind of quick. Look, we can hit maybe 100. I'm just seeing if I can. Yep, there we go. 100. Let's break, because I don't want to... I don't want a ticket or anything like that, so we can hit 100. I wonder what the speed, um, so to speak, the speed limit of this thing is. It probably isn't super quick, but it ain't gonna be super bad as well. So this thing, uh, it's got some speed. Anyway, we're gonna get a car wash here if it's open. I think it's a 24-7 one, so we'll just swing it into here. Get it all car washed and all situated. And we'll be able to uh, drive back. It's probably going to get dirty by the time I get back anyway. But let's get a car wash. Right, let me just get out. We're going to pay for a car wash down here. Here we go. Slash do a pays for car wash. There we go. 
And uh, let's get her cleaned. Alright, there she is. All nice and clean. Look how nice it looks when it's clean, by the way. Can we just appreciate the chrome on there? I mean, I don't know if it's a little bit hard to see in the in the night of things. Uh, is there a light anywhere? There's a light, light a little bit above, so let's just move up a little tiny bit. Here we go. There's a little light down here, so we can... You can kind of just about see. It looks super nice. The orange is very, very orange, but looks good. And then there's huge chrome wheels, a huge chrome front. It does look really nice. I do like this truck. Pretty badass. So we're going to be driving this for a couple of days. Hopefully you guys are going to enjoy this. I've never had anything like this. The lowered truck. So, I mean, you know, I just recently got a lifted truck and I'm already joining the lowered truck club. So that's quite a quite a jump. What am I missing? I mean, I kind of feel like I have everything, right? Am I missing, uh, uh, maybe I'm missing like a mega, mega truck or something. And I just went over a pothole. Damn it. I need to look out for these, especially in this thing. This thing does not handle potholes very well at all, so I need to make sure we are somewhat careful of those. There goes a police officer. I thought I was getting pulled over. It looks like now we're good. We're fine. I wonder if we can do a wheelie. Let's see. Let's break a little bit. Let's see if we go. Hell yeah, suckers. Oh, yeah, this thing does a little wheelie. Pretty badass. So, anyway, let's get this, uh, we're gonna get home. Bark it up. Let's not get pulled over for being too low. <laughs> Getting pulled over for being too low. Damn. Strict rules, huh? Okay, here we go. We gotta be careful there in the dirt road. I don't know how rough this is gonna be or how well this truck's gonna do. If I hear scraping, it's gonna make me a little bit sad. So far, so good. It's not too bad. Don't scrape bad, please. Okay, it's doing okay. It is doing okay. But well, we're not on the rough part yet. We're not on the really dirt part that my drive is on. Maybe I'm gonna have to like park this outside somewhere. That would really suck. I hope I don't have to. But here we go. We're coming up to the area. So this should be okay. But this turn down here, this turn right here. Let's see. It's gonna be okay. Oh, oh, just about. Oh, I had a little scraping, but it shouldn't be too bad. We're gonna be okay. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Hopefully, you're going to like the lifted truck. You're going to be seeing this, I mean, lifted, lowered truck. You're going to be seeing this a lot more. I'll see you in the next one. And uh, have a great day. Take it easy, guys. Bye.